Hello Aries, this is going to be your monthly tarot reading for June 2017. So Aries, this will be for you, whether you're under the sun, moon, or rising sign of Aries. You may resonate with this reading. Okay, and as always, I'm going to be using the Universal Tarot deck for this spread. Let's go ahead and get into it, Aries. So your overall energy you have is the Knight of Pentacles, okay? And you have quite a few Pentacles, actually. So this could be geared towards finances this month. It could be very heavy for you of a focus. Um, maybe slight, there may be a slight of a delay with some type of, um, financial investment or something around business or something because I see that it's a lot of patience it's requiring a lot of patience from you because um, in your challenge position you have the hermit card so I kind of feel like the challenge is going to be for you to lay low being that you're a fire sign you're very much out of your element this month you're actually have a lot of earth as well okay the hermit even being the sign of Virgo. So that's the earth sign. Having to take back some times, I kind of feel like there's more that you could, more information or um, maybe some more ideas that could come or some sort of help if you kind of sit back or lay low for a little bit and kind of not try to move so fast or towards something right away. It doesn't always have to be finances. It could even be relations to other material things, a home, or something like that um you know whatever it is that you need finances it could be you know whatever you need money for could be some sort of delay in that but i feel like spirits telling you to kind of lay low there's more information that you might be missing out on and that's going to be challenging for you your suggested approach is to have patience with the seven of pentacles kind of waiting to reap the benefits or waiting for the harvest to come but i feel like the waiting really is because there's more for you to know okay there's something more that you can get from the situation that um requires some time some patience not rushing ahead um which is usually your fiery energy you know you want to go 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 but not this month it's not what's being asked of you then with your focus you have the two of pentacles um so this is like your focus. So your focus is to find balance with the situation, I feel, okay? Maybe you have a tendency to be a little frivolous in this area or you have an, like this um, uh, kind of like a, not a tendency, maybe. It could be just for this month a little tempted to go overboard financially or invest in something that you might not be ready for or in the space to at this moment. The spirit's trying to, you know, tell you that you need to kind of wait things out. Weigh the pros and cons. Don't rush into it. The outcome you have is the Page of Cups. So I kind of feel like maybe um, some offers are going to come in or maybe someone giving you the, the advice that you need or someone you know, coming from a more, um, you know, someone trustworthy coming in could be a Pisces. Okay. Someone of a water sign usually, but it could even just be someone who's, you know, always that sound of reason and, you know, supportive and compassion and understanding with you or someone that you love or someone very close to you might be able to assist you with the situation is what I feel. The Wheel of Fortune, this is like a cycle and I feel like things are gonna work out for you. You just have to have patience with with this whole situation. It's under divine control, especially with the seven of um, Pentacles. The number seven is God's number. The Hermit, the Major Arcana, which is telling you 
to kind of go within a little bit, take a step back, get more information. The Ten of Cups and the Four of Swords. So really contemplate your desires, really, I feel. Um, maybe something, because I'm hearing like, car so so for some of you it could be that you want a car or something you're trying to pay off your car something in relation to cars um obviously finances are involved with it kind of feel like spirit wants you to to think about this like meditate if this is truly what you want whatever the move is that you're trying to make is it really in your highest good and is it really what you want how it's also like what i'm getting to is Feel into the energy of how would you feel if this actually came to pass, whatever your ultimate goal is. How would you feel if it actually happened for you? It's kind of what I'm getting. Then there's you at the bottom of the deck, the page of wands. So could be this is the action that you're being guided to take. Um, as far as getting more information, I feel like that's really what it is because the four of swords or the swords just in general is mental energy. It's also communication but you have two meditation cards here, introspection with the hermit and the four of swords, contemplating. So contemplate this. Is this really truly what you desire? Is this really going to make you happy? Do you really need the car right now? Do you really need to pay the car off right now? Do you really need to get that extra part? You know, certain things like that, I feel. Like, is it necessary? Is this truly what you desire? And it's not that it isn't or it is. I feel like it's just you figuring that out is what all spirit wants you to do okay all right so that's pretty much what i'm getting with this um for you for your focus this month aries so i hope that that resonates and that it will be helpful for you as always you guys i'm sending you much love and until next month